Alright. Let's explore a little more. Hmm. I can get tons of units through Discovery, so I guess I'll do this. Let me get my... I'm on Okondali Ninja, aren't I? Let me unplug my mouse real quick. Plug in my keyboard. There we go. I think we explore this planet a little bit more and find out what's going on with it. Let's see what's going on here. Okondo and Inge. It's a very interesting eco life, eco system here. I'm gonna just analyze all this stuff real quick, I guess. Why are you time? Abgar Habite. Alright. I'm just analyzing the local life so we can get some credits from it. Suspension fluid can be bought from galactic trade terminals. Well, I have suspension fluid. So that's not a problem. I already recorded you guys, so I guess that's fair. It's definitely hot here, so I gotta be careful. I already made an electron vapor. Unless I sold it. I sold it. <laughs> okay. Well, can't blame me for being smart really dumb in this instance. Hello. Ex Toltellum Horium. Okay. Well, I guess we should probably look around for the rest of the species here. There's only seven species on this planet. What's that? I should probably go check that out. It's also a very weird design. Oop. Yeah, I guess I should find some shade and cool off a bit. I saw an outpost over there. Okay, apparently... Oh, my... Life support's almost offline. Okay, I need carbon. Well, I definitely do need all of these resources, but definitely carbon. Carbon's at the top of the list. That's Thamion. Thamion is useful. Let's load up carbon real quick. Grab the Thamion so I can charge up my life support again. Uh, okay. That should be enough. That support's at 95. What's this? Iridium? Oh, okay. Some Iridium just hanging out. Can always use it. Okay, let's check out this outpost. I can actually probably look for... A drop pod or something. That would be pretty interesting. A 
A fascination bead? Okay. Let's save this valley as discovered. Felis Vientaria. Okay. Huh. Alright. One second. Let's see. I can craft a bypass chip, thankfully. I need to get some cover and cool off a little bit. We are getting pretty dangerously low on our thermal protection. Oops, okay, I can't cross this. Okay, where's the entrance to this place? Okay. Stabilizing. That's good. Impact damage sigma. Very well. Uh, oop. Beacon set long ago from a distance system awaits my response. 1702 7 D21 2170 Yeah. It was going left one to the left. Every time. Okay, that gave me an indication of what's nearby, along with a ruin, unidentified of wavelength, sending data. Huh. Okay. That's kind of important to know, actually. I'm gonna check this out first. Also, is this just... Oh, it does that. Okay. That's useful. If it didn't park my ship nearby, I mean. Okay. Let's go to this location over here first. It's a beacon, so... Let's just park this. I wonder if there's even any water nearby. I doubt it. There's a resource under there that I need to grab. This is going to take a little bit of time. Yeah, alright, alright. There we go. Tons of iron. Cannon damage theta. That's good. Oh. Well, we didn't do it. Anybody here know who did it? Nope. Alright. Nobody knows who did it. More beacons. That is definitely a facility on the top left. Advanced life form detected in 17 minutes. That's an installation. Let's go to that shelter first. It's just over the mountain, I think. There's another facility.
Oh, we went too high. All right, we almost left atmosphere. There we go. Okay, and park. I think we're landing on the site. Yep. All right. Edeluge Plains. Let's just mark this as found. Inventory full, all right. Let's see what kind of friendly foe is here. Hey! Viking at arms. Duen. Okay. Interloper. Suit malfunctions. Viking ancients. Share oxygen. Oh, we need carbon? Alright. Well, that's not carbon, that's plutonium. Weapon charge depleted. We've already discovered that. There's apparently a species we haven't discovered just over the ridge. Grab some carbon. So there's apparently a species we haven't discovered just over the ridge. Yep, there's the guy. Alright. Hello, you. Aren't you pretty? A giant cow. Veg he's a vegetarian. Huh. Okay. Is it still hot here? Because it just turned to night. All right. Oh, that's entire. That's an entire carbon source. Okay, I'll take it. More carbon, the better. I want to do a bunch of trades with this guy, so all the better. Interloper, Viking. Yeah, I don't know that. Request a new word. Thank you. Dowry. Well, I don't know how useful that word's gonna be. I just want to get a bunch of new words. Viking warrior interloper. Uh. Pressure. All right. It's over here. Obedient theory one. Eleven slots. Compared to my 12 slot weapon. Nah. Death, 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 death. Aller Warrior. Oh boy. He seems less aggressive than I might expect. I'll request repair. Yeah. I mean, I needed a reason to get rid of the Viking Dagger, so... Could have sold it for units, but whatever. 
Viking High Warrior Interloper. Oh boy. Heavy. Viking Warrior Interloper Dogdo. Um. Oh boy. I really don't want to push my limits with this guy. Can't scan him, so. Guess I'll just uh, keep going. Quest new word. Sentinel. <laughs> well, that's a good word to know as well. Alright. Uh, well, nothing of use there. Oh, I'm out of carbon. Okay. No problem. Sell items for my inventories. I don't need this fascination bead. Okay, starship inventory. Nothing there. Buy items. I need suspension fluid. Whatever the hell Lemium is. Okay. Collect one electron vapor. Okay, I can make an electron vapor. I need more plutonium, which is really lucky for me because it's just nearby. In chunks. Okay, let's do a scan. I should have zinc in my ship, right? Let's check. No, I only have iron. So I'm gonna have to find some zinc. I got two shielding shards. Just charge it with Amium real quick. That's an Oxide. I don't need Oxide. Mm -hmm. I want to discard. Um, I could use Copper for something. I think I need Heridium for something. Let's charge plutonium. What else? Pulse engine, I think, needs thamium. I just discarded that, so whoops. Okay. This should be zinc over here. Unless this is platinum. Yeah, this is platinum. I need I know zinc is a silicate. At the very least. I just need to find silicate. And just finding a lot of oxides. No, oh, here's here might be our lucky break. Zinc, platinum, nope. Yeah, this is also platinum. I think it's also platinum. Yeah. Uh. Alright. I think our best bet might just be to check out the store. Let's go to the shelter real quick and see if I can buy some zinc over there. 
First things first, though, there might be an upgrade or a blueprint over there that I can use. Recoil stabilizer, yeah. Nothing else of use here. Okay, let's check and see if there's any zinc in the trade center. And also, it's become day, so it looks like our, uh... Looks like the heat's back on. <sighs> Alright, buy items. Is there zinc? There is zinc. Enough for me to get 20 units worth. Okay. Oop. I'm gonna change my starship. Okay. Okay, there we go. That should be enough for me to make antimatter. I need to go back over there. And I should be able to craft it now. I need plutonium. Yeah, okay. And I do need heridium. So I guess one real quick grab of some plutonium. There we go. That'll do it. Okay, craft the electron vapor. And now craft antimatter. And now I should be able to craft a warp cell. I need thamium. Okay. Well, I'm just going to buy that at the stock. I think I'll have to start becoming a trader at this point. How much is thamium? They only have... 31 supply as well. Okay. Well, I think it's time for us to go searching for some thamium. Because we need uh, 100 to make a fuel cell. Okay, so thamium is a conductor. Or an isotope, rather. So we gotta look for red, and hope it's and hope it's an isotope that we need. That's a shield regeneration. Yep, here's Thamia. Uh, is this more? Yes, it is. That's plutonium. I have 99. Well. There's, there's some more thamium right there. Thank heavens. Okay. We have enough thamium to craft a warp cell now. Craft a product. Build a warp cell. There we go. So now I've made a warp cell. Okay, charge equipment with the warp cell. Okay. Now let's go to that ruin that we marked a while ago. Where is it? I don't want to leave yet until I see that ruin. Plenty of points to go to.
Okay, let me land real quick. Just until I can find my... Just until I can orient myself. wasn't too far from this, I believe. Okay, let's head back. I think we lost ourselves a little bit. Okay, there's where we were earlier. I think I lost those ruins. I'll be able to find it again if I activate a beacon. Start here. Maybe there's something I can do to activate a ruin beacon. Well, first off, I can build a bypass chip, just in case there is actually a point here. Camp Lutus. Seem like I can get a point here. Okay. Four, four, six, three. as the location of a new world is displayed on the screen. I might be able to regain the signal, actually. Yeah, there's the ruins. Good. That's what I wanted. Oop, okay, hold on. Reorient myself. Let's go to the ruins. Before I lose the signal again. Won't be too long. And 
and park. This will be a last destination before we go and explore the rest of the worlds. What kind of words do we get learned here? Viking for bless. Oh man. Abandon. Starship. There's a cave over there. Well, here's the interaction for them. For this place. I'm gonna explore this place a little more though. This could go on for miles. Wow. Uh oh. Okay. Let's uh let's not do that again. <laughs> let's take the careful way. Legacy of Navi Cell. Memories of a long deceased tribe of Viking warriors flows from the stone marker. The Book of Herc speaks the, of the rise of the travelers. They shall ascend, delving into the boundless void. The Viking shall then impede their ascent, for the travelers must prevail. So decree is the word of Herc. Seek help with language. My knowledge of the Viking increases. Good. Viking for restore. Is that it? This is my standing is increased? Okay, I only learned one word, I guess. But hey, all the better. Let's increase our life support again. Okay, off we go. Back into the atmosphere. Back into space. There's a space station over there. It'll take two hours to get there. Let's cut that down to about a minute. Traveling a long way from the base planet. Only because I don't want to go yet. I want to see everything there is to offer in this area alone. And I want to explore my world, my galaxy, my universe. Okay. This looks very gaseous. goes. This, is, this looks like a, a snow planet. Oh, it's ocean. It's an oceanic planet. Look at this. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to be able to explore this planet. 
Okay. This is a beacon. Dry gust, passive, rare, intermittent. Okay. Well, I've discovered this planet. Tiny little continent here. Absolutely nothing nearby. But I know what I'm going to do. An advanced life form over there? 40 minutes away? Well, I wonder if this entire place is an ocean planet. worth noting that that's the planet we were just on. Okay, let's go over to the shelter over here. Because I don't really know if we can go underwater, and I don't want to take any bets yet, until I'm sure. It certainly looks like it's been around for a while. So much water. It's really cool that I found a dominantly water planet now. Kind of scary, too. Looks like the shelter's at the very top. Peak. I'll take some carbon just in case. I need it to trade. I don't think I need an obedient theory, no. Short, short burst adapter. Okay. Hi. Oh. Let me fix that. Hi. Proposition, dowry. Studying the image of another young warrior on his pad, the pictured warrior looks vi virile and impressive. Um, one carbon short. Well, <laughs> okay. A grazing creature? I haven't found that either. 
Or this. Huh. Well. Still a lot to explore here. Let's go underwater. Let's find a nice place to go underwater. Oh. Oh, I don't have enough plutonium. Alright, hold on. I'll fix that. There's some plutonium over there. There we go. Okay. We got the plutonium. Now we can bug out. First, let's get a room. Let's first let's find out if there's any uh, monoliths nearby. Okay, let's look for a monolith. Yep, there's a monolith right over there. Okay, let's go there. And hopefully it's closer to the shoreline. There has to be f local fauna here. Oh, wait. Hi, you. Alright, launch thrusters. Refilling with plutonium, and off you go. Looks like it's going to be closer to the shoreline. This might be our best bet to see underwater. Yeah. That could have been a bad landing. your usual monolith. Not bad. Knowledge stone. A keen word for power. Okay. I think we learned like 40. We learned 50 words. We're getting there. Maybe we'll have an entire alphabet by the time we're done. By keen word for ally. Allegiance. Those are all equally good words to know. Ruins of Agitasio Lichus? Lichus. Yeah. The ancient stone cups materialize in front of the monolith. One is filled with a dark red viscous fluid. The other contains a sticky fluid that is bright yellow and smells powerfully bitter. On the stone tablet behind the cups, ancient glyphs swirl to form an image. A powerful and muscular warrior sur surrounded by red halo challenges and opponent clad in bright yellow armor. Viking Ancients. Drink the bitter yellow liquid, or drink the viscous red liquid? Suddenly an unknown power repairs all my equipment. Weird. <laughs> I learned the Atlas word for something. Instant. That's a good thing to know. Let's land a little bit closer to the shore. Like, right over there, I'd say. And land. Landing area not clear? Okay. Hold on. There we go. Oh, boy. <laughs> the, round, the ground isn't solid enough. Let's try over there. Here we go. 
This should be good. This should do it. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Well, I'm about to find out if this is acidic water. Oh, man. Okay. I'm actually pretty excited. Let's get our life support back up a little bit. Okay. Well, here it goes. And take a deep breath. Okay, I do have a limited oxygen meter, so that's good. Oxygen protection is 75%. That's fine, that gives me plenty of time to search. Arva white? Is this iron? Yeah. Okay, let's go back up for air real quick. I just realized I can't sprint underwater. Okay. Oop. I actually need to get out of the water for that. Noted. Uh, okay. I saw a cave down there that I want to explore. <laughs> this is actually really cool. Oh man, I've waited years to do stuff like this. I absolutely adore this kind of stuff. Even though I really could use more oxygen. Because it's kind of bumming me out that I can't explore the entirety of this ocean. swim faster underwater, I would totally do it, though, because it looks really awesome down there. This is a picture and a half. It's beautiful. Waited years for games like this. Just open exploration worlds. I think I can leave this place happy. Let's get out of here. Hereby name this galaxy Blaze Kick Geo Two. Let's proceed. 
back to this galaxy at any time. Here goes. Galaxy 3. There has to be a space station nearby. Yep. Alright. Looks like I'm going that way. You had my attention and find us, hear us. Coming, coming for you, Atlas. No fauna, no sentinels. This is kind of scary. Gek word for docking. That's a good word to know. Gek word for gek. That's also very good to know. And first. Always first. Remnants of Omesoi Deval. Okay. Well, show me what you got. Monster and Stylant on the planet's surface. It does not belong here, neither do I. Follow the Atlas, obey the Atlas, accept your reward. The Atlas offers me guidance, purpose, meaning, significance in an uncaring galaxy. All I must do is follow its path and its orders. I see lines of codes, rings of numbers, and a bizarre structure. I'm, I feel sure conviction that great power awaits me if I travel to this distant place. I got a warp cell. 
ascend to the stars. I would if I weren't so far away from my ship. Seems like this is trying to tell me something. I'm not sure what. Okay, let's go to the actual planet. Oops. There's the planet. Just go there. Okay. Well, we're here. Nope. Destiny lies in the beyond. 